हेलो नमस्ते सलाम वालेकुम शास्त्रीय काल वेलकम बैक टू अनदर सेशन विथ योर वाशअप एट वारेवा डॉट काम टुडे वी गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू मेक गोभी मकनी दैट इज यूजिंग कॉलीफ्लावर वी गोइंग टू मेक इट विथ अवर सिल्की टमाटो ग्रेवी आई एम टेलिंग यू वंस यू गाइस मेक दिस एट होम दिस विल बिकम योर फेवरेट मकनी सो फॉर दिस आई एम गोइंग टू मेक द मकनी ग्रेवी यूजिंग द प्रेजर कुकर मेथड फर्स्ट आई एम गोइंग टू एड सम butter cardamom cloves cinnamon and bay leaf so i put everything in a uh, muslin cloth and then just uh, put it in this butter add onion to add some sweetness to the sour tomatoes we going to add some cashew nuts we are going to saute these onions till they are slightly transparent in this add salt add ginger garlic paste we going to saute this ginger garlic paste for 1 minute lot of red chili and little bit of green chili in fact i prefer to add kashmiri red chilies that will give a very nice red color to your gravy just add tomatoes there is so much moisture in this tomatoes and onions that you don't need to add any water just put the lid of uh, this pressure cooker we going to cook this for around 15 minutes now you know after cooking this for around uh, 15 to 20 minutes that is almost 5 6 whistles of a pressure cooker you know there's no point putting everything in a blender so first we going to extract all the liquid that is coming from this and only the solids we going to put in a blender and just make into a puree after straining all this uh, blended paste all you are left with with the seeds and the skin of the tomatoes you know just add one or two uh, teaspoons of sugar in this much gravy the real good flavor for uh, your makhani comes by adding kasuri methi you can pretty much add anything any vegetables into this and they will taste fantastic this is a basic uh, you know nice uh, makhani gravy but this is not truly a makhani gravy until unless you add cream and butter here i have taken pieces of cauliflower what i did is i cut them in such a way that uh, i get big pieces of cauliflower like this and for this just take some corn starch and if you want you can also add uh, some all purpose flour in this some crushed pepper some cumin powder coriander powder and little bit of salt now just mix all of this and add just very little water and make this like a paste it should not be thick but it should be like a nice coating batter paste you know look at this this looks fantastic in this we are going to take this uh, cauliflower what i did with this cauliflower is i just added some turmeric in hot in water and just uh, blanch this cauliflower so that you know any of the insects or anything is there they just come out when you blanch now just coat this cauliflower on all sides now i'm going to do with the same thing with other okay okay you don't need much of this batter just very little the way i did that should be good enough now add some oil in a pan now we going to fry this uh, cauliflower in the oil if you want you can deep fry but you can also shallow fry just like this and uh, let it cook on both sides till it is slightly golden in color so you cook this cauliflower look at them they become nice and crispy wow just uh, transfer it into another paper towel if the pieces are slightly thinner they cook much faster if you cut them slightly thicker they may take little more time now this piece of cauliflower is also nicely cooked transfer it and whatever the extra oil is here just remove it off and you can use it in other cookings so now in the same pan you know we going to add our makhani gravy in this add butter wow look at this this is good and also you can add cream and the cauliflower pieces which you have cooked wow and just let this uh, cauliflower soak in the nice uh, makhani gravy oof 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 wow this is good just after uh, letting this cauliflower simmer for around 1 minute this is all done all we need to do is you know check the seasoning if you need to add salt or anything perfect i don't need to add anything in this we're going to add some cream if you want to add more of it you can add but uh, this should be good enough and then just mix this along with this sauce wow look at this 
suddenly the sauce becomes so nice and silky and to look also the color is fantastic and this is all ready to serve i'm telling you cauliflower is slightly crunchy still with nice silky makkani gravy and fantastic and the sauce of silky wow you can enjoy this with uh, naan roti fulka rumali roti anything and it is fantastic dear friends i hope you enjoyed today's session of learning how to make this cauliflower makkani gobi makkani or butter cauliflower but do not forget vareva is all about inspiring others to cook so please post your recipes and cooking tips at vareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking thank you wow look at this mm you know when the gravy is so good you call this finger looking good look at this cauliflower mm